with this society and culture that's changing so rapidly, we need to keep up with technology and information. The Moog Simodont gives us the ability to bridge that gap. Traditional teaching models right now just involves mannequins and plastic teeth. The Moog Simodont is a virtual reality haptic simulator. It has the look and feel and touch of an actual clinical experience. There's the ability to approach various disciplines through the simulator. So a student can decide on treatment, on design of preparation, restorative material selection, and then they can prepare the tooth in order to receive a restorative material. It reaches all aspects of clinical dentistry. When we work on the traditional mannequin heads with the plastic teeth, it's really just a solid piece of plastic with a screw in the middle. If you took your handpiece or a drill and kind of went through the tooth, it just feels like plastic until you hit the screw, as opposed to a virtual reality experience. When you go through the different layers of the tooth, you actually feel the changes. That is so much more realistic or really mimics the clinical experience in a real person's mouth. When I actually had the chance to sit down on there, I was like, wow, this is amazing. It is so real. The feedback, the way it shows you the tooth, the design, you end up becoming more proficient faster. While we're using it, we're able to change out the tooth as many times as we want. So it makes the turnover uh, much faster and much more simple. It's like basically playing a video game. You start a game, you don't do so well, you hit the reset button, you start over. Hitting reset and starting again, they might be able to do another full preparation in five to ten minutes. What I really loved about it the most was that my faculty could also see what I was working and how I was holding my handpiece. As a teacher, you can monitor several students and you can watch the entire process of their exercise or their activity. You have all that data saved and so you can measure their improvement or if they're struggling some area, you're able to identify specifically what areas they're struggling with. This is not so much a replacement of the phantom head but a very critical adjunct to the training of the student. Really just having the technology here kind of allows you to practice that a whole bunch of times before you sit down uh, with a mannequin and with a white plastic tooth and actually do the cutting. When I switched back to my plastic tooth, I actually kind of felt more confident in what I was gonna do and I wasn't gonna make the same mistakes. A lot of times, students are afraid to you know, work on patients if they haven't done that procedure yet. So having a kind of a virtual reality experience kind of allows you to try it out, test it out, ask a bunch of questions before you go across the street and try it on a real person. You get the opportunity to make more mistakes and that's where you learn. It's the 21st century. Every dental school should have one of these. We're gonna end up coming out as more prepared than schools that are using a traditional method. We're really fortunate to be at a school that has all this technology here because our generation is moving towards more technology and we're gonna have to adapt while we're in clinic with our patients as well. So in a sense, this is training us for crossing the street and moving to clinic. Students these days, they're looking for this kind of technology. They live it every day, and if you don't deliver, you're missing the boat with this. This technology is helping us tremendously in moving students forward. It wasn't hard for us to decide this is something we need to have at Western U. So we feel very lucky to have a partner like Mo to be able to develop the future of dentistry.